guys welcome back to my channel so yes i am looking a little rough i just woke up I, you know make breakfast and everything for me and baby girl she's right there um every morning i'm trying to get up and potty train her so that's how our morning is looking but i'm about to go make us some breakfast and get the day started i have some packages i have a package coming today that i got her which is something i felt like she would learn from so when it comes i'll show you guys and i'm gonna enter a clip where i <laughs> i found out she could get up by her um out her crib by herself so i am going to enter that clip so you guys can see how sneaky this little girl is. These kids are sneaky. Okay, I am so proud of my baby. She been peed in the potty. It's the second morning. She peed in the potty. Um, I'm trying to get her so used to sitting on the potty and everything like that. And she peed. She peed. Oh, I'm so happy. We are getting somewhere. <laughs> we are getting somewhere. But yes, uh, I am so proud of her. Oh my God, we are making progress. So the package have arrived. Um, this is her little toy. I'm going to open it and let you guys see what exactly is in here. Apples. I see. Games. Apples. So this is what I got her, just so she could learn how to, her colors basically. It's basically about organizing. And I think this was so cute. Yeah, All right, put it to the side. We need this. Ooh, look, we need this one. It also comes with the, the colors. But yeah, let's, we're gonna play with her a little bit. I realized I got all the way into making this video and I did not wish you guys a happy new year. Like, you know, I did not wish you guys, I'm wishing you guys a happy, happy new year. I wish this year bring nothing but blessings on blessings on blessings. And I wish you guys overflow of money, overflow of happiness for me i have like coming into the new year started off december like i'm just gonna give you guys a quick little rundown december started off rough i was supposed to start vlogmas but my two-year-old daughter went through her molar phase so i could not really pick up the camera because she was like always crying and she was like very clingy so to me. I could re I couldn't really do anything I didn't want to feel like make her feel like I was neglecting her to pick up the camera and everything like that so I kind of had to push back vlogmas so I started off a little late. I was up I, I put out like I was up to like 12 videos or 11 in total or 12 in total and um I had to stop because my son got sick and um come to find out he had covid and he gave it to me because i basically was his caregiver so me and him was sick and that is like that's the like i had caught covid before but only my smell and taste left this time like my smell and taste didn't leave but my whole body was just like whoo it was like really ridiculous and feeling like that and having to take care of another sick child then my daughter she didn't really get sick she only had a fever for two days which was like once one day one like a fever one day i was able to keep it down 
and um i gave her medicine and then the next day she had like a slight fever which was only like 90 something you know uh 99 point something so it wasn't bad at all then after that she didn't get no fever she didn't have any symptoms or nothing like that I literally had to basically get up every day and take like basically fend for my kids like you know I couldn't neglect them because I wasn't feeling good so I had to push through like when I tell you every day I felt like I felt a different something the first day was my chest my chest was hurting and then like after that like my body just felt like you know tired i was exhausted and then after that it was like i started feeling nauseous and then like my 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 lips was feeling numb like if like my sense of taste and smell was leaving but it didn't lightheaded dizzy and all that and it was it was rough it was rough trying to do that and every time i like every day that i felt like it was okay like i was okay and i felt good enough to record like i just like something was just like no 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 so i basically just listened to my body and i just i didn't pick up the camera um now fast forward to new year's boy new year's eve i basically wanted seafood i got some seafood i did like i try i basically filmed a try and haul for sheen and um during that time when i was filming that like i don't know like i just felt like lightheaded nauseous dizzy i was like what the hell is going on so i literally had to stop that literally go lay down and i drank some um ginger ale like five minutes after me laid down i threw up all the food that i ate now that's the second time i got sick off of buying seafood from outside the first time i was in the bronx with my family i ordered from the same restaurant which was hook and reel so um i did that and the first time i literally felt like i felt sick like my stomach was like bubbling so that's when i basically like i felt like i had like a almost like a 24 hour stomach virus so that's that happened and then this time that happened and i ordered uh i live here in queens so i ordered from queens the same um restaurant just different location and i literally felt the same way i don't know how they cooking their food or anything like that but baby i can't eat seafood outside no yeah that i I'd rather just buy the stuff and make it myself um and yeah so that's basically like my christmas and new year's was like blah because i was i was in here a lot of people out here getting covid um or just basically getting sick um but yeah i just wanted to have a little rant with you guys anyway i don't know if i'm gonna incorporate the cooking into this video i guess i'll just show you guys how everything turned out and yeah again like you guys stay safe out there and i'm wishing you guys a very very happy new year and may you crush your goals this year whatever you have in mind um So I got some yellow rice, I got some broccoli, wait, and I got some curry chicken, you can't really see it. I'm about to pour me a drink, so I got this yellow towel Moscato, I'm hoping that is good, so yeah. It's like sweet. It says a little sweet and a little fizzy. So that's exactly what it tastes like. It's not bad, but basically that is my night. So this concludes the daily vlog that I'm going to be posting. It is a typical day in my life. Um, so yeah guys anyway thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe that yeah, this is no phony business i don't have extravagant stuff i don't have luxury items and you know i just i'm a regular degla girl from new york so if you like what you see like i said again don't forget to like comment and subscribe and interact with me in the comments okay see you in the next video bye